Hey guys, Bill Maru here. Uh, I have done crazy work in my room. BAM! What's that? What's that? That's a nightcrawler wall. Oh, man. <laughs> There's so much crawler. You know, some of you may be asking, Bill, why do you have this piece of trash on your wall? I'll tell you why. That Deadpool on my wall, right in front of my customizing station, that's there as a reminder to never, ever tamper with a perfect design. Ugh, it's so bad. Oh! We got some, uh, got my old Mortal Kombat's up, but I found get this. Oh my god. Ran over some bubble wrap. Made me pee. There's a, uh, got the three pack of the old cyber robots, which it says Mortal Kombat Classic, and on the back it has a picture of Mortal Kombat 1 character select screen, so that doesn't make any sense. Also found old Johnny Cage. Um, I'm not taking these out of the package. Damn it, bubble wrap. Over 15 points of articulation. Who cares? They look pretty. They'll stay in the package. As you can tell, I'm a uh, big Robin fan. Oh, what's that? Let's see, Arkham City Robin. Thanks to Configure for that. My wife, for our anniversary, one year, married, coming up this Friday, November 11th. <coughs> She got me another Robin with the Joker, and what's that? It's freaking the Joker dressed as a cop and Batman. So there you go. Got this Marvel poster on the wall. Got this, which is the best X-Men poster freaking ever, man. It's just so damn good. Alex Ross at his best. A little Daredevil action going on up there uh, behind the stained glass. Um, I'll be putting these up in a minute. God damn bubble wrap. Here it is, people. In all its glory. The wall of crawl. What's that? Oh, it's the saddest comic ever. Spoiler alert. Nightcrawler freaking dies in that comic. Anyways, here's a uh, little card I saw drawn right in front of me by local artist Paul Milligan here in Texas. Got a couple of awesome statues. In fact, my wife bought me this statue. She bought me this statue. She bought me both of those sweet, sweet aqua beauties. Uh, and she bought me that. Oh, I found my Deadpool. It's chilling. Up top, I tried to go giant size X Men. It's the old Toy Biz release. Bought it because it has Nightcrawler in it. A buddy Rocky Sloan gave me that. Uh, it's got Nightcrawler in it. You can't tell, but uh, one of those is the regular and one of those is the variant. I only bought the variant because it had a Bamfing Nightcrawler in it. Ah, here's a uh, wall o Punisher, or shelf o Punisher. Uh, that's a custom I did. Open this guy, John Paul Martinez gave me. Uh, I love that freaking Hawkeye. Painted the helmet on this Thor. This camera's not really picking up his... the awesome paint job I did on it. Step stool. Man's best friend. If you have eight foot shelves. Oh man. You want to talk about amazing. My buddy Rocky Sloan gave me this the other night. It's my favorite. Oh god. I love Billy Tan. What's that? Oh, that's a signature. 
The Shia or Empire was one of my favorite runs. Just a great cast of characters. A couple of my favorites right there. These guys need no introduction. Oh, and Rocky's son gave me this because it had Nightcrawler on it. How freaking sweet is that? And I mean sweet as in, wow, a freaking kid gave me this. I mean, I don't know any grown-ups that'll give me stuff like that for free just for thinking of it. It's paint on the wall here. This is all my Citadel paints. These are all the old junkers, the old model master, but I still keep them around just in case. Here's my pile of night crawlers. The well, lighting may not be the best here, but I'll tell you right now, there is a lot of night crawler going on here. What's that? Oh, it's a custom. You can't see that. It's not done yet. Here's a figure Thomas Wiley sent me for freaking free, man. Really cool guy. Uh, he sent him to me because he didn't have the bands, so naturally, I took a soda Ryu and uh, painted the headband black, dry brushed it gray, dry brushed his hat, has his little do rag a little more gray, and I believe that little piece right here came from a 300 figure or something. Either way, it was already dry brushed gray, but I dry brushed it more gray because that's how I customize. I don't know how many ultimate characters have been made, but I've got a Nightcrawler and now I've got Iceman, so I'm um, not right. Here is a request from me if anybody in the community, and I mean anybody, knows where I can get a mask for this Iron Man, please let me know, because Tony's just naked without it. I'm pretty sure I brought this up last video, actually. Yeah, I was doing something like that talking to the camera. Anyways, that's that. Another little wall of Aquaman here. Aquaman, 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 Aquaman. Oh, John Constantine. That's a custom. I did that. Oh, you thought that was real smoke? No, it's just cotton. Oh, Plastic Man. Thanks to uh, Julian Moreno, man. Freaking awesome guy. Got a great deal on it. See the black and whites in the back? My wife convinced me to buy these when they first came out, all the individual packages. I was just going to get Donatello, and she's like, hey, you should get them all, because you'll regret it later. And man, would she have been right. So, my custom Ash here. My custom Army of Two figures. I don't know how many of you guys are into that game, but I couldn't stand the Nika versions because of their legs. Top half, awesome. Bottom half, piece of junk. So, what do you do? You fix it. Give them some Nika Street Fighter 4 Guile pants on Rios. Uh, painted them all, camouflaged up. Attached all the uh, goodies. And then he used a deluxe spike for Salem. Uh, and then here's another custom video game character. Uh, Alex Mercer from Prototype. And here's my favorite custom video game character. Bam! That's my custom Liu Kang. Look at that, man. Mortal Kombat 9, Liu Kang. I painted those. I sculpted that. That's not going to focus. So, it's not really that impressive until you see it in focus. Anyways, very proud of that one. I'm not proud of all of my customs but that's one that I absolutely love. Here's another one I love. My custom Moon Knight. I mean this Moon Knight. That Moon Knight. This is my custom Sabretooth. Berserker, whatever you want to call it. I went overboard with the uh, blood splatter on this one so yeah kind of lost all the sculpting. I mean, I have hair sculpted from here down to here, and you can hardly tell. I sculpted shorts, ripped shorts off. This is from a Soda Sagat, and the head, obviously, from a Nika Akuma with added sideburns, sculpted in his little point, and then there's a freaking chip! Okay. Well, let me know what you guys think. Uh, I guess in the comments.
Did I go overboard? Too much blood? Or just enough? A couple more customs here. My Nick Fury. Me as Hank Pym, pretty much. Uh, my Luke Cage. Custom Nightcrawler. Custom Havoc. What else did I do? I haven't done, like, hardly any villains. What villain should I do? Guys, let me know. Let me know. Somebody tell me. Oh, wait a minute. There's an ultimate Magneto. That's a blonde Hulkling, you can tell. Here's something really, really cool. Uh, if you guys, if any of you DC fans out there, it's not the most updated book, but this is a really, really cool book. The DC Comics Action Figure Archive. Look at these old school things, man. There's some really cool stuff in here. I don't know. It just kind of shows you the evolution of figures um, in alphabetical order. Uh, I don't know. I thought it was really cool. It was a cheap buy. Not to mention it'll let you know on some figures that maybe you should pick up. Oh. God, I love that Batman. Hey, is, if anybody has the Dark Knight Returns Batman, loose or MOC, MIB, I need that figure. Okay, here's a little treat for you guys. If you guys have not read Black Sad, then please pick this up. Um, if you guys are into anthropomorphic people, you know, animals taking on human characteristics, this is for you. I mean, it's a noir-esque, fantastic main character. Ugh, read it. I'm going to do a custom of him soon. I don't want to give away too much. But just know. Look at that. So sleepy. Got that for the wife for donating to Toys for Tots. Because... It's just rude to not donate it. Um, but look at this. Yeah. That is a Yoshi crawler. This pretty much takes my wife's favorite character and my favorite character and merges them into one. Uh, Rocky Sloan got this for me and my wife as an anniversary gift. Uh, this was done by John Harmon, which, John, this is absolutely amazing. These ears are seamless. The tail seamless as well. I mean, look at that thing. Incredible. Incredible. Anyways, you guys had to see that. Also put these pictures up on the wall if you guys give a crap. It's not really comic related, but it's freaking my house, so <coughs> love it.